Hi, this is the LandofCoins.com YouTube channel. Thanks for checking this video out. And I'm going to show you how to identify a 1795 Liberty Cap half cent in the C2 variety. Of the 1795 half cents, there are six different varieties, and this is the number two of those six. And they call it the C2. And if you don't know what LandofCoins.com is, LandofCoins.com is an online rare coin auction website that you can uh, buy and sell your coins with no transaction fees. There's no buyer's fees. There's no seller's fees. And you can put the coins on the website yourself if you want to sell them. Or, and then, of course, you can buy coins too. So check out LandofCoins.com if you haven't already. Uh, back to the 1795 Liberty Cap Half Cent. This one is the punctuated date variety. So it's the C2, it's the first of the punctuated dates. And also this is the lettered edge variety. If you see letters on the edge of the coin, such as this, for example, and it's punctuated, then more than likely you could have the lettered edge C2 variety. Okay, so first if you see a punctuated date, half cent just look at the edge and see if there's letters on it if there is then what you're also going to want to look for to determine if it's a c2 or not is uh, first of all you're going to look at the date and if you see the date here it says uh, 1795 you can barely see it in this picture but right here I'm going to draw a little line here next to it right above that see that line there's, it look, almost looks like a comma, so it's uh, it looks like one comma seven nine five. That's called the punctuated date for the uh, seventeen ninety five half cents. And there are more than just one variety of the the, the punctuated date. There's a few out of the six, but uh, first you want to look at the edge of the coin, see if you have letters. Then look at the date one seven nine five the comma. All right, and then after that, we're going to go to the reverse of the coin. And on the back, you're going to want to have 17 leaves on the left branch and 16 leaves on the right. And you're also going to want to have four berries. And we'll go through these two. I'll count the berries for you real quick. To save time, I won't count the leaves because you can count those, you know, 17 leaves on the left, 16 leaves on the right. And the berries, you're going to want four and four. And the berries, I'm just going to mark it right here. There's one berry, two berry, three berry, and four berry. And on the other side, you'll see the little one here. That's the one that's hard to see sometimes, especially on uh, more worn circulated coins. There's a berry there, two three and four and a quick observation that a lot of uh, astute half cents look for when they're trying to identify uh, a coin is uh, real quick they'll see if the two berries are on the left and right side of the ribbon because that's a quick indication right away uh, it eliminates one or two of the it, it eliminates two varieties right away once you get familiar with the six varieties of the 1795 uh, just looking at those two it eliminates uh, five and six immediately but uh, this is how you identify a 1795 C2 half cent. So thanks for watching this video and make sure you check out landofcoins.com if you haven't already. So you can buy and sell coins and also research coins with good information.